Oh, thanks. Uh, got baited into coming after him. Because I could have just grabbed the explosive and thrown it away and probably been fine. But I wanted to uh, stop him from shooting at me. And I didn't take the time to grab him and spin him. No, it's alright. But yeah, I forgot I actually have to like break out of the starting glass container. I wonder what is actually like the best way of moving if you want to avoid people hitting you if like actually like this messes them up like even like small stuff like that or oh nice <laughs> I got a speed boost so I could go straight into a corner because uh, I wonder if they try to predict where you're gonna go and then fire at you so if you wiggle it throws off that or I'm not sure if that's something I could even like look at the code and figure out I don't think it'll be that obvious if wiggle miss <laughs> that'd be nice Eloquent code, well, well documented code would be beautiful. I, all the code, actually I haven't done any coding, well I did a little bit of coding today, but like, pretty much all of what I did today was just commenting code, which is not the worst experience, because you can, you, it helps you find flaws in what you've made because you're like, oh, why do I have this here? Well, I actually don't know why I have this here. This is actually redundant, so I can remove it. Uh, so you can learn like that. And it's the same thing about like, re like writing notes while you're reading it sort of thing instead of like taking pictures of it. Because as you're writing it down, you're actually making connections sort of thing and processing it less as just words and more is like actually information. So if something doesn't make sense when you write it down, then you can actually ask questions and figure it out. And all that. I have a lot of people in my comp side classes that still like take pictures of the notes, I guess. I don't I mean I'm sure there's like some reason for that that Boy, I'm not thinking. But I've always been like handwriting it sort of thing. The only class I really shouldn't have done that in is there's one where she literally just gives us the code for like the labs and I write it down and then have to transcribe it to my like computer. So it'd just be better just cut out the middleman and just sh like sh code it straight into it. I like having it to reference even if I never go back to reread it again. It's nice to have just for like reference or just writing it down so that I understood it better. I don't think I have, like, any crazy, like, study strategies that nobody else has. Oh yeah, I forgot that I have, like, over a minute of time save in one le or probably two levels at the very beginning. <sighs> did I crash on album two last run? I don't think I did. No, I just crashed on, uh, album four, which is apparently possible. You know, we do what we can, even if my computer slash the game cannot, like, prevent itself from crashing for, like, 30 minutes. And we're actually getting to the point where I can say that it runs 30 minutes long and actually it be 30 minutes long. Almost. That sound effect they use right there, I'm pretty sure I remember from uh, Norwood Suite using the exact same powering down audio. I'm doing it, I'm doing my best. That's literally all I can do. If it crashes, there's nothing I did. I can just do it again. Do it better. Do it faster. I, I don't really get annoyed by games crashing or silly stuff that's outside my door. I'm more annoyed when like I just make a mistake that I definitely definitely could have prevented. I'm not really sure what I could have done different there to stop myself from taking two hits. Um, They were just too far away for me to grab. Boy, am I impressive. 
You can get really unlucky in that and just have like three long hallways where enemies are facing straight the direction you're going. And you can't do a ton to stop them from shooting you, except like if there's cover and obviously in a long hallway there's not really anything that can help you out with that. So even for this, it's like duck and weave is the strategy right now. I definitely playing this on the controller is a little bit easier. Surprisingly, I always thought mouse would make this a little bit easier, but because it makes you keep your momentum a lot more. I should have just let him shot me, actually. I mean, it's a good not to just, again, be the mindset of just like, oh, the guy can just shoot me, it's fine. <laughs> I have no clue how I managed to not blow that guy up, but I'm proud of me. I think that's the solution a lot to, like, not blowing yourself up. <laughs> just stun the dude. Ah, I might as well have just, like, not wasted the time to attack the guy if he was gonna get a shot and hit me anyways, but... Ooh, that is really sketchy. <laughs> More sketchy than Skechers. <laughs> you can have him, bye. <laughs> Ooh, that's the door I need to go in. Oh, he's not dead. Again. I keep getting these situations where it's like, I'll stop opening the door to deal with him. And... Um, it just ends up with me uh, taking a hit anyways. I mean, that's like unlucky. Like, I... It's a rug right before I should have hit him. Or would have hit him even. Okay, cool. I was worried they were gonna, one of them was gonna hit me. The ending group of enemies looked kind of sketchy. Okay, um, I think we can do the album two thing. Uh, I think we deathless that. Yeah, that's good. First time we've done that. That was a pretty good time. Love self an album, yeah. It's easy to actually take a hit in that first room, just by sheer accident. Get kind of booped. Oh, I thought there would be a door there. Not that I've not seen the room like generate that way before, but for some reason I was like, yeah, there's definitely a door there. You know, there definitely isn't. Whatever way that guy went, I'm like, I'm immediately going the opposite. I don't care. That way could be tons shorter. I am surprised that guy didn't shoot at me. He had a straight line and I was not dodging at all. I took that corner kind of poorly. That's all right. We good. I did do the skip. Oh, we got that to contend with. I need to not die or it'll crash and it'll be my fault. <laughs> I hope that doing the skip on this doesn't like make the game like less stable somehow or something ridiculous. That would be kind of silly. I mean, I mean, I don't have it on a run yet, so it wouldn't be that bad, but it is 15 seconds for free. Boy, am I impressive. It tried. It tried really hard to crash. Okay, so after this is where we're going to cross over to the other side. I got really lucky that that uh, assault rifle guy got shot by some random dude. Ooh, hi. I thought you would get stunned. Obviously, the top's the right way. The bottom's just an empty room, I think. I mean, it might not be empty, but... A uh, room with no doors. All right. Just need to do over it. The game didn't crash, so... That's relief. Ooh, not the good way to go. That was worth wasting an extra second to not get hit there, because I already got hit once. And uh, health is not a commodity we have a ton of. 
Okay, cool. That was a really easy floor. We just got a couple more. Be good. Didn't have to deal with the sniper there. A lot of these levels, I think, are just like reading where the sniper is and just going somewhere else. And then just not blowing yourself up, obviously. Let's not mess up concrete jungle. Can save a little bit of time then. I actually went the right way. I was thinking in my head, I'm like, which direction do you go? I know you don't go to the right. So I'm assuming the left. <laughs> There's only so many options. Hi. Uh, I guess I kill you because, or throw you far away. Because he was going to be in a very good angle to shoot me. Um, so we do concrete jung. Oh, okay, that is the fine way. I thought that was blocked off. Ooh, hi. He might hit me still. Nope. I'm actually surprised that guy didn't shoot me. There was no reason to kill that guy, so... Didn't even bother. Ooh. I was not expecting to take that hit, but we're good. Okay. The second floor of this, I need to go to the top, and... Oh, that's not a... That looks like you could probably fit through there. We are a chunky monkey, apparently. I almost threw that towards the corner there. That would have not been very fun. Uh, this should be where it is. Yep. This tiny dude chases after me all the way across the bridge. I will be shocked, but... Uh, and not very enthused, but it'll be hilarious at least. Keep forgetting you can shoot through glass and the bolt keeps going, as if this is not... You know... I know how real life works. I know glass works. I should be able to uh, apply this knowledge. He probably could have hit me there, which would have been fine, I think. I think this is the last floor. Yeah, we could have easily taken those two hits and been fine. Why is it called low pressure? I'm pretty sure I die a lot on this level. Oh, that's not a room. That's perfectly fine to do. A little bit safer. That guy might shoot me from behind. He might hit me twice. He might hit me again. I popped out right as they were shooting me instead of how I should have, which was after. Uh, I don't think I can get to him in time. Oh, I did. Cool. That was kind of sketchy. Ooh, he might get me. Mmm, that was a good shot. I was hoping that he would hit the wall that was right next to him. That's alright. That's our first death of the run. Decently late into album two isn't too bad. We got a couple just like tiny dudes that were chasing after us because I didn't deal with them. Um, so I just let them get pop shots on me. And that was okay to take because I was at full health, but I really... Ooh, let's take you out, actually. Let's go this way. Oh, he got me right as I was getting him. I was literally on my finger down, pressing trigger to kill him. Need to get inputs on the screen so we can see how close I am to actually hitting them. Ooh, wrong way. Go away. Don't notice me. They need like a couple of seconds to like warm up, so... Oh, that was the wrong decision. I should have just ran away. That sucks to die a couple times after being deathless for most of the run, but... Alright. We can make up some time in album four. We can also save a little bit of time here just by playing... Well, not a lot of time here, but... Some. Well, that was the least eventful floor two that you could have ever had. Well, could have been even less eventful if there was just nobody there, but there's just two dudes chilling. They just forgot to put people on that level, I guess. I was taking one hit there and I was okay with that. Two hits I did not sign up for. I might die. I have a feeling the tiny is going to come out of nowhere and just pop me. He's going to like parasail down from the top of the screen. 
Uh, is there anyone here? We're good. That was not how I wanted that to go. That guy hitting me twice was very surprising. Usually enemies don't hit you uh, twice that quickly. I guess they assault rifle guys, that's why, why they're dangerous, but that's okay. Darn, we had... I was on the way to do a deathless of uh, that one as well, which would have been cool. Sub 15 isn't that bad. Could have been a 13 minute time-ish. Or sub 14, but... It's alright. This is still one of the better paced runs I've had. So we can save a minute from not dying in no man's land, then we can save a minute and... Yeah, we can get uh, sub 30. Get a 29 minute time. right ahead. Map feels weird. I don't think it usually has that long of a hallway at the end, but maybe it does. I thumb it's not like how much I've been just holding straight right, but I mean that's that's this game. Ooh, hello! I missed him and then flipped out. <laughs> Let's go around. Because there was a bunch of dudes there that were uh, ready to probably murder me. Still two minutes ahead. Should be good. Surprised that guy didn't start shooting. The assault rifle guys, out of like all the enemies that are in this chapter, I mean the flamethrower guys obviously, not even talking about them, but they'll fire, bef like if you have a fair fight where you run straight up to most enemies, you can outspeed them or at least grab them before they were to like shoot you. So they'll, I'm pretty sure, they usually went out unless you grab them really early. That's all right. Maybe it'll keep people away from bullying me. Guess not. <sighs> we only took one hit, so we should be fine for this portion. Only really sketchy when you have one health, but even then, like, we would have been fine. The assault rifle guy had popped us that should have been a little bit more sketchy. But none of them even fired at us once we got inside. Alright, so power's gonna go out, which usually isn't too bad except for the fact that we had... We just had one dude that was chasing after us the entire time last time we did this level. I don't know what was his, his problem, but he was chasing. Oh nice, cool. I was fully expected to take a shot there. If they, uh... They're staring straight at you like this. Usually they will uh, get to you first. Oh, that's the wrong way. That's fine. Usually you have to... Come up from behind them or just otherwise not engage them straight on. But like usually during the run you don't like stop to like try to hide and like let people go by or anything. You just take those hits if they happen, and it's pretty rare that you are in a situation where you can't grab them first. Alright, so we have the one death that we have in this, uh... in this area in our PB, which is about a, a little bit over a minute uh, long death, or a minute worth of time we lost for it. Um, so it must have been, like, kind of close to the end. Or maybe I just got a really bad map generation and then died. That's the worst one, like... The game screws you over with... How they make the map, and then... 
you still die anyways, like just trying to muscle through it. Okay, please shoot. Thank you. Shoot again. Thanks. I should have like ran towards him, but I thought I'd be okay. I was nice and patient too. I was like, you shoot at a rock a couple times, you're fine. The main problem was the uh, the guy shot me at the door, the blast door, because I wasn't willing to go off the door, because I know he would have hit me anyways. But usually there's like nobody sitting next to the door at all, like right here. I mean, there's a guy now, but it wasn't before. The only problem now is the uh, because there was a guy ne that came up next to the door, I had to like Try to take cover right as I left, and then I got shot by everybody on the other side of the door. Oh, just leave. Please don't shoot me. Thanks. <laughs> well, we're trading a minute of time save. Um, if we get this one first try. Um, we'll, we'll be a little bit ahead of where we started, because that death I had was... Oh, okay. Well, I'm just leaving that room. <laughs> or that area. That is not even worth trying to kill everyone there. I've not killed anyone yet. They just all kind of hit each other. Uh, I don't like having to do this detour. This isn't even a detour. He blew himself up. What a guy. That was a big old waste of time. But I haven't been hit yet, so we'll be fine if someone does. No one did, but if someone had, we'd have been fine. Uh, till two minutes ahead. We need to be like four minutes ahead to that was a really dumb hit to take at the beginning um, We still need to be get save two more minutes somewhere So like rough seas we need to save two minutes or save a minute and then just save more time overall playing better um, To get sub uh, 30 But like a 30 minute time in general would be really nice if we get like 30 30 or like a high 30 like that's fine Just my goal is to get sub 30 But I'm at 34 right now is my PB so we can do baby steps All right last level of album three is when they start dropping bombs Hopefully we don't have anything tragic happen like last time where a bomb dropped at the very end That was very hard to see Please blow them up before they shoot me. Thanks. I mean they shot me but didn't shoot me it's okay if they shoot me as long as they don't hit me. Or shoot at me, I guess, whatever. Anyway. I almost blew myself up there. I tried really hard. Uh, we have taken zero damage this entire time, but the um, bombs are insta-kills, so... Doesn't matter. But we're fine now. You're safe once you're at this point. I don't know if you can stop running once the uh, Boy, am I the ship pops up, or if you need to uh, keep running the entire time. I haven't checked it out. Yeah, Cloud's nice to finish that on. I only died once, which is pretty good. Uh, if we don't die at all on this, it'll be really, really nice. We we can die like once on the. Uh, the last level, and that's reasonable, I guess. But I like the first try. Like, hold fast, I should first try pretty consistently. Rough Seas is kind of a crapshoot, to say the very least. Oh, uh, we'll see. I guess I'm going down here. That is not how I wanted to run this, but... You don't want to like really go like straight vertical. You want to go diagonally if you can help. But that was pretty much the only way to get down here. So please don't sit there and just keep shooting me over and over again. You know why I hate these guys, the tiny dudes? Because they do stuff like that. And now I'm gonna die. Okay, I got lucky. <laughs> the tiny dudes will just sit there and they'll somehow be off screen, but accurate enough to just completely. Ruin your day. There's that guy right there. He's chasing after me. He's probably gonna kill me. He tried really hard. That was not not a good run through of that at all. And what can you do? 
let's avoid the explosive guy and not blow ourselves up while it's dark or at all actually okay uh, I shouldn't have grabbed him because if someone had randomly shot me I would have blown up Yeah, if you're holding an explosive guy and someone shoots you, it's just an instant death. That's one of the things you have to be careful of. Bye. Alright, actually this is a pretty clean run through of this. Saved a minute, so we're in like 31 territory right now. Or like really high 30. We just need to not have a horde of tiny dudes ravenously tear us apart in this level. Hey look, there they are. Can you get set on fire please? Thank you. I actually appreciate that. That's very generous of you. Please don't. Please don't continue to chase after me. I feel like they shoot like the furthest off screen like they can be okay we're fine where did you even come from i killed everyone and then you just spawned out of the ashes or something i don't know uh down here up here i'm not really sure where to go anymore i guess kill everyone never mind all right i was just trying to duck in there not to die but like neither of those directions actually went anywhere Ah, it's hit squad. <laughs> Please go through. Just finish the level. <laughs> I wasn't gonna survive if I stayed in that hallway, but I really was just looking to go around them, not to kill them. It's all right. We have a little bit of a, a breather here. Which seems weird to call this level a breather, but it is now. Thank you. Thank you. I don't think I want to be this far to the bottom because they tend to like put blocks in front of like the entire direction there. Thank you. That's a good hit. Um, please don't hit me, thanks. Now you can hit me, though. Okay. Don't bump into things. <laughs> Alright. That was almost a gold split. It's about as well as you can do that. Minus, uh, like, usually you have, like, random containers that are in your way or stuff like that. Okay, so for this level, there's a, like, a little, like, barricade section that's in the middle. So I have to make sure to not go too far to either of the sides because I have to wait for that to pop up. Yeah, this thing right here. If you go on either side of it, you have to walk all the way up. That was me trying to avoid it. That was just not a very good attempt. It's so easy to go the wrong way in this area. Shout out to the guy blowing himself up. That was a real interesting display thank you hit me oh that's the way through what a guy actually you can probably hit me with the rocket and that's all right i haven't been hit by a lot of rockets yet the rockets are interesting speed boost it's lost three seconds just because i kind of got in a few dead ends but nothing too bad Kind of trying to walk in a way where the shotgun guys will still like shoot me. Thank you for setting that guy on fire that was supposed to hit me. <laughs> I really don't like speed boosts. No, I did not just go the wrong way so that the rocket launcher guy could die. Um, I'm just. Uh, uh, I think I'm actually close to death. Not really, but close enough. Closer than I should be. Uh, and I'm not close to the exit. Cool. Alright, so we're... Yeah, we'll be like a 31 pace. Mm -mm -mm. 
That's only with three deaths. Not to like overlook the fact that I still have to do this level where I died on it like two or three times. Last time I did it. Probably should focus. I might take a hit here. Nope, he put his bullet into a bush. Pretty quiet. Since I have like such high health, it probably is actually worth taking out the tranquilizer guys instead of like the really, really dangerous guys. But I may mean, still want to kill both of them. Cool. Um, actually, will this be a barely a third? Um, uh, maybe. Oh, there you go. Okay, that's sub 31 at least. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> 